Hey, oh, my planet coaster friends, Johnny Five Alive here, and I am joined with a Zay4. Howdy. And welcome back to another Park Spotlight Contest Edition. Today, we're going to be looking at Tain Mahuta, created by Bukul. And here he says, Hey, Johnny, this is my entry for the mini park contest. The lore of the park is as follows. Three trees stand in harmony. One of the trees, however, has special powers, mana, and in the manifested by the Muri god Tain Mahuta, the god of the forest and the birds, deep within the big tree lies its heart, which can be seen beating and pumping mana through the tree and into the branches, attracting all sorts of flora and fauna. Step inside this magical world, the god Tain Mahuta, and experience something you have never experienced before. Park is best experienced at nighttime from the guest perspective. Also, it is basically one path that brings you along the park, so don't get lost in the big tree. Uh, so try to stay on it if you are if you don't want to fall. Your your cat needs you. <laughs> you spawn at the guest spawn at the top the treetops, and you make your way through the entrance and make your way to the right of the smiling oak pub to the rooted brewery for some awesome views of the Ferris wheel. Smiling Oak Pub, is that a homage to Smiling Gal, I wonder? All <laughs> rides, flat rides excluded, have a story to keep an eye out for, the lore in each queue. All right, something we have never experienced before. Sounds exciting, so stay tuned and let's check it out. All right, we are in a tree park, a tree park. Are you tree ready, Zafar? Absolutely. I love I love tree houses and tree parks. Yeah, and this is quite neat. The yeah. roots, the the terrain, the roots, and the everything come together. It gives you quite a freaking cool perspective. Yeah, it looks really good. It, the, he's done really nicely to make the the terrain actually feel like branches of a tree. Yes, that is not easy to do. And with that, the lighting, it's freaking cool. Yeah. Really freaking cool. And there's a lot of fireflies. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's fairy dust. Keep telling fairy me. dust. <laughs> this way to smiling. I thought you said it was one path. You said it was one path. There's five. <laughs> We're getting lost. I'm going to follow the tree. My cat is going to be alone. Uh -oh. Let's look down. Oh, yeah, there's lots of paths there. I think they were talking about... Oh, this way to the Smiling Oak. Is that the way you went? Well, I just kind of want to look around. Oh, uh, yeah. Make sure... if that See, if that looped around, I wouldn't... You know. Now now we saw that side. Let's go up to the Smiling Oak tree, and then we'll come back down to the Arch Bridge. Ooh, got some music up there. Sounds like a good time. I don't know if you guys can hear it. It might be quiet. Yeah, I, I love the how they how they did the Planet Coaster theme and all these different sort of styles. That's some that's so funny. I think Zelix I would say the exact same thing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Pip shots, 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 shots. <laughs> now, now you're imagining the pip shot girl twerking. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Or, uh, what's her name? The girl with the guns? Pew, pew, pew. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Miss Ellie. Ren Miss Ellie. Yeah, she seems like the one that would twerk. Not not Renee, boo. She seems... No. Too, adven <laughs> too adventurous. Oh. Yeah. I it bet Emily does once she get a drunk. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Renee Fu is more the, uh, Tomb Raider <laughs> style. She just wants to go out there and get shit yeah. done. Wow. Yeah. Got a little first wheel here. Nobody's coming up here. Oh, uh, yeah, they probably got lost as... <laughs> I, I'm really curious to see what kind of views we have up here. It's quite cool. I like the gear works. Mm hmm. That's really smart. It's nicely skinned. Yeah, agreed. I like it. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's got like a, almost a steampunky sort of feel to it. Yeah, and that's the, that's the kind of ride you would want to go on after some drinks. You don't want to go on anything too crazy. <laughs> right? Yeah, absolutely. This is such a cozy park. Yeah. Nice yeah, it's clothes. Got, yeah, exactly. Really beautiful atmosphere. Mm. Very pleasant. Only people coming up to the pub are a bunch of kids. <laughs> I guess they're just selling water. Hip shots. Oh. Oh, they just broke. Let's get out of here before oh. we get in trouble. <laughs> oh, the, the branches are breaking beneath us. We're gonna plummet. That's a long way down. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Back to the front and center. So this is where they were saying, uh, Bugie was saying that it's, uh, one path, New Zealand's biggest living coral, Kori tree? Kori tree named after the Mori god, Mahuta, meaning the king of the tree. King of the tree. Toilets, staff. You want to see the toilets? <laughs> Please do not dispose human waste over the ledge. Nice. What does I'm this just say? For, just fertilizing. Oh my gosh. Pink penguins using human human uh, feces for warmth. Lovely. That's disgusting. <laughs> oh. Well, that's a hilarious Easter egg. <laughs> yeah. The man is all sapped out of this tree. There's nothing left. <laughs> uh oh. What was over here? Staff facility. Curious to know if you have any Easter eggs on this one. No. Nope, just a quaint, cozy building. I think. Have a nice. Ooh. I like this bridge. Nice this little covered bridge. This looks or amazing. Semi covered. A herpesea dominella mala oak. <laughs> Not this font again. Disqualified. Uh oh. Seen this too much. Yeah. It's a nice font. And it's a it's a bit it's a bit Comic Sans though, you know. And, and why has is it is it not recolorable? Hmm? Every, it, oh, is it a TMT key? TMT it, key it, pieces. It's recolorable. So everybody that's used this font. Not a single person has recolored it. It's just always orange. Oh, it's box lights. Is it? That's weird. Oh, that is weird. That's I guess it just gives it that rounded edge. Yeah, because it's a smaller piece than... It's, it's a smaller square than you can really get with the... Uh, the even the scenery pieces. Right. But yeah. Interesting. Do we go down or right? Down or right? Uh, Mana Dream Square or... You yeah. make the call. Down looks kind of scary. I'm going to go to the Mana Dream Square. Okay. <laughs> Up we go. It, it's dark down there. Ooh, we got a coaster. At least going past. Gotta watch the screen, save for. Oh, sorry. I walk faster than you do. <laughs> yeah, well, that's because everyone wants me to take it slow. <laughs> Not me. I literally go at the absolute slowest speed uh, and still like, get I complaints love... on every yeah. video. I love these. These are really nice. The flowers and the... Aw, sweet. The blue hanging light. Fried cake. Yeah, that's really pretty. Sweet ring-shaped fried cake. You mean funnel cake? Is that what that's supposed to mean? Oh. Or donuts? I thought what? it might have been an acronym or something, and that would have been smart, but it's not. This way to Mana Shruf Point. Shruf <laughs> yeah. Uh, Tain Mahuta, the Mori god of the forest and the birds, is manifested in this tree. Its mana, inner strength, power is expressed in various ways. Legends say the only that only those of pure soul can truly witness the powers of the mighty Tain Mahuta. Well, I have no soul song. I'm just gonna get out of queue now. Say I didn't you know you were. 
Go on with that. I didn't know you were a ginger. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, why'd you do that? Oh, he doesn't mean it. It's a meme. It's a meme. All right, this is quite an interesting queue. Oh, that's kind of unexpected. Yeah, a huntsman. Mana, the huntsman. It's uh, quite the length on this one. Surprised to see that considering it's all in a tree. I'm really curious to know where this is going to take us. <laughs> it takes us qu quite a bit, it seems. All right, sit back and enjoy. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised there's no sort of music or speaking. Right, here we go. We got something. Oh, laser eyes. He's checking your soul and he's like, thumbs up. You may proceed. <laughs> Toadstools. Surge of mana. That's nice. What was that? I'm not sure. <laughs> Aw, fat birdies. Thank God they're not pink penguins. <laughs> I wonder if they're... I didn't see them very well. I wonder if they're uh, the kiwi birds. They're little fat little birds. Ah, uh, yes. Yeah, that would make sense. I like how it's lighting up all the flowers. Or, did I see that uh -huh. right? Oh, look at all the birdhouses. Yeah, that's a lot of birdhouses. I think that was a rooster that we saw back there. <laughs> we have one coming up here, I think. I have to look. Is that a rooster? I think so. Uh, that other one was. Those are chickens? I th I think there's some other kind of like parody style bird. I don't know. It's hard to see in the dark. I I, I believe he's uh, re released a separate uh, Steam Workshop collection of all the animals he made for this. Oh, that's fun. So, yeah, you can... a lot more in this tree than meets the eye. Yes, there is. Woo! Ooh. Fireworks. Magic. Cool. So that's a good way to do your fireworks. Just do it on a ride. Then I won't <laughs> ever miss it. Right? <laughs> yeah. Unless you miss the entire ride and then have to go and... <laughs> <laughs> Put it in afterwards. <laughs> hey, just let me move on with my life. Gosh. Mm. All right. I I thought that was nice. They're like the m mana elements were nice. They're, it's beautiful the way they're throw the throughout the way, but it's missing that magic ambience and that magic music and. Yeah, music and I mean sound effects. Or, yeah, and I think like if you had some sort of narration over the top, I think that would like ma massively push it over the edge to like you right. know outstanding. Yeah, because like, it's like the foundation of everything's there, and then we're just missing. Yeah, we're missing the That's mana. Like, yeah, some, so, something telling us what's going on. <laughs> yeah, for sure. But you can tell a story through sound effects and music and the speakers, mm -hmm. and you can do quite a bit, so... Yeah. We had the, all the visuals. There's not we much did. you could have done better with the visuals. It's yeah. just, yeah, 
it'd have been nicer to have some something oral going on that would that was sort of matched matched to bring the experience together. Wait, we went up this, didn't we? That was no. Uh, this, I, I'm so confused. Yeah, in fact, I've yeah. Okay, yeah. And a point this is where the I'm... main branch of the tree that supplies the branches above with mana, resulting in the surrounding flowers to turn blue. Ooh. I like these blue, blue flowers. These are where I'm at right now, too. Yeah, this is mana. The mana tree center. Yeah. Cow juice? Gross. Cow juice. Well, that's milk. Save your cook save, <laughs> savory cookies. These are not savory cookies. I get <laughs> yeah, Pizza is a one massive cookie. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> It's so big you have to cut it into slices. Yeah. Uh, so you're going to the timber shroom forest? I suppose I am. Please do not eat the mushrooms. Uh-oh. Just wanna... Timber! Okay, so... Before we go that way, let's just ride this ride here. Do -do 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 -do. Uh, I like how it's in a similar. Uh, it's like a. Th it's skinned. Fal very similar falcon to falcon or something. Eagle. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's cool. It's very good. I was saying like the ride skin is seen very similar to the other one is, so it sort of like brings it back around with the the sort of almost western. Oh right, I see what you're saying. Steampunk style. This one's. Just... I'm not sure which. Tower. I'm not sure which way I should be facing, but I think this is right. Okay. <laughs> oh, I get off just as it rips up. Yeah, let's just manually control it. Let's see what we would have saw. I mean, it's really hard to look through these branches and make sense of anything, but it's still really cool based off the lighting and the shadows, and it's quite neat. Okay. I'm a little... Okay. So there is a... There's definitely an inverted coaster. I'm yep. not sure where you can get I on think, it. I know. think we got to keep going up, because this... Uh, past the mushrooms, this way... Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, this is that's the name of the one I'm confused about because okay. it's yeah, it's not connected. Um, Watch out for falling bird poo. Oh, it's gross. Lovely. But there's Waha Tain and K. Let's go check out K. Okay, okay, these are the two coasters. Okay. Good stuff. Okay. There's cats in the trees, or is that a mouse? A cat? I think it's a m mouse. But he said, don't let your cat fall. Huh. I think he was talking about Fizzy. You are a mouse. Oh, you are a mouse desperate to find food for your family. Jumping from branch to branch, you make your way through the tree. I thought that was squirrels. Uh, <laughs> but stay focused. One missed jump and result in a horrible death. You don't want to leave your family starving, do you? Well, the ma the tame mahaha watch over you. Have you ever seen rats in trees? I'm sh I'm fairly sure they go pretty much everywhere. <laughs> You don't see them because you, they pretty much just don't come out except at night. Okay, make sure an adult is in the front seat. Yeah, if you're with a kid, they their point of view is lower down, and it gets obstructed by the, the top of the, the front of the car. Right. So what are we looking at here? Wild mouse uh, in it, a tree. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. It's the it's the same. It's that old style wild mouse with the uh, the train of the three th cars. Is she or four cars? Is she adult enough or is she a teen? <laughs> I think she's an adult. Why don't we just do this then? I think that works better. Okay. Let's check it out. Off we go. The ride's broken on mine, so I'll watch yours. <laughs> N nice of you to finally join me. <laughs> oh, no. You have your uses every once in a while. <laughs> ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. We're going up a long lift. Yeah, Exploration mouse neat. coaster. <laughs> Time to jump. How long is this? Thing? 
A little smoke effect for the jump. See, now why... Why wasn't any of this, like this, here's the music, here's the sound effects, here's the action events. Well, where was this on the Huntsman? Smashing windows. Right? Yeah, well, it didn't need to be like, you know, explosions and stuff, but you, yeah, some sort of ambient sound effects. Magical sounds. Music. Whee! Oh well, yeah, definitely oh. not the explosions, but you know, <laughs> unless it's an <laughs> yeah. explosion of mana. Cheese! Wow, they they got the this is cool ride out here. <laughs> I really like this ride. Yeah, I'd I'd ride this again. This is cool. <laughs> it might be fun to ride this during the day to see how it looks during the day. I think they wanted me to stay at nighttime, but mm -hmm. maybe just. Well, I, th I think we probably owe it to the viewers to at least have a look at how it looks during the day. Right. I like these big mice. <laughs> Whee! Oh, we got a loop! We got a loop! This is really fun. Yeah. One of the most creative coasters in the entire contest. It, it reminds me of, um, I did... I doubt you've seen it, but there was an old Disney cartoon called Gummy Bears, and in the opening montage of the the, the music playing, they had like a coaster that took them through like the woods and through the caves into their wherever they lived. I remember and, Care Bears. <laughs> yeah, not Care Bears, but it, yeah, it was like they lived in the forest in the woods or something, and they. <laughs> and I always I, thought I Disney should have built a coaster said, like that. I doubt you've seen it as. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone knows I have never seen any TV yes. before. <laughs> yeah. yeah, and plus this was when I was a kid, which is probably like, you know, 10 years before you were born, so. <laughs> okay. All right, well, that was super fun. Do we ride it again a day or do we just check it out a day? How do you want to? Well, well, there's another coaster, so maybe. Well, we could also look at the park at day, but that, that was a mm -hmm. really incredible experience. I mean, yeah, one I mean, one this, of my favorite a... coasters in the entire contest, to be honest. It was just fun, playful, it was different, unique atmosphere. Um, really felt fun in the trees like that. Hmm. And, it, and it's a coaster type you don't see that often, so it was fun seeing it used and used well. Mm-hmm. So now we're going up more. Uh, yeah. Watch out for the bird poo. Wahoo Tane. I wonder Whoa. if it's Tane or Tane. Tane. I don't know. This is something different. Yes. I did Experience a loop. Experience the life of a bird in Tane's tree and fly through the tops, but be aware. One wrong move and you may end up on the ground with a broken wing or neck. Yikes. <laughs> that, that, that that went to 11 real quick. <laughs> or neck. Yeah. These guys are cute. You might break your arm or your neck. <laughs> yeah. Bird poop everywhere is grossing me out. Wahoo Tane. Let's check it out. How we ride in this seat? I guess so. Um, 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 um. I <laughs> perspective on this is really quite wild yeah i mean yeah it's 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 pretty crazy it's it's up and down you're inverted not inverted and it's really hard to know which way is which it's kind of cool i'm a big fan yeah, yeah, yeah. it's not the, sus the suspended one it's the the two-seater inverted i thought it was the suspended one first I love it. Really good job, Bugle. Oh, a little lift. Got a bigger lift. We're not done there. Unless we're getting I back to the station. Yeah, I've got a feeling this is just taking you back to the station. A little uh. Wait. <laughs> Speed her up. This is probably when they were pooping on the ground. They're stuck there. They're like, let us go. <laughs> wow. Uh, 
It's really crazy. I love it. <laughs> You know, I like the wild mouse, and then this just was like a more extreme version of that, but mm -hmm. with birds instead of mice, and that's cool. I, I like it. You only really needed one main attraction, and I would have been happy with just the mouse ride. But then you kind of put an extreme coaster with a similar vibe to it, but a little bit mm -hmm. more crazy, you know, more like they had inversions. I think the mouse hat ride had one or two inversions, but this was a lot more crazier. I mean, how many did it say we had in there? Five. Oh. And, it's uh, a lot more than that. <laughs> yeah, and added yeah. some speeds no, I, in there. I, I like how the how the mouse the mouse ride is a mouse coaster, and it felt like a mouse scurrying around, and Jumping. then the, yeah, yeah, and then the, this the felt like a bird. The, yeah, you really felt like a bird flying through the branches of the trees, and and then you have the the huntsman as well teaching you about the mana of the tree. So mm -hmm. it, you kind of, I mean, that the, that one could have definitely been a little bit better, but because you. We only required to have one main attraction. Um, mm -hmm. That they were well, I, that they were done so yeah. exceptionally well that it's like okay, well, we can definitely, you know, don't like, I don't I don't think you need to improve the Huntsman considering how much more content and awesome attractions are in the park. So it's kind of made up for I, it. I don't I don't well I don't think it was a dis I, well that's the thing it's it's not it, it's not like it was bad it just felt disappointing that it didn't do more in that the, the addition of music and sound right. effects yes I feel like it would have it would have added so much um, for you know so it was it was literally like two percent away from being like perfect right right and memorable exactly. and that that yeah. sound that that would have brought it together and solidified yeah. the whole thing um, whereas those ones had all that they weren't missing that and you can see the difference that it makes having those sound effects and the the, the music and the action and like the, the animatronics and different things um, it's cool I mean they weren't animatronics but they were yeah they felt like it because you're passing by them and there's sounds and music and yeah. things we, yeah, it felt animated really good custom animals and yeah. like I said he, I think he's combine these all into a, a blueprint so if you wanted to use them in your own parks or your own creations you can grab them and do that mm -hmm. so the only place that I believe that we missed is that basement that you were scared to go in oh that's right so yeah, we gotta... it's all dark and spooky there we go the Tain Mahudas here we go well we should have oh my goodness wow I... Oh my goodness, indeed. I'm, I'm just gonna sit there and you guys can pause it and give it a read for yourself because this is gonna take <laughs> me 10 minutes. Oh boy, there it is. And uh, I wanna see this. Is there a sequencer for this? Hear the mana, feel the mana, the mighty Tains Mahuda's manifestation, manifestation, the heart of the tree. And he did mention in the read that there was a heart that's throbbing. That's really cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Woo! Wow, surging mana to the rest of the park. I like this. Yeah, what I, what I would have suggested for bug uh, for bug is um, putting some vista points around the inside so mm. that the guests would come around and and look, look at, at it. it. Yeah, or even a firework in the center because they'll come and look up at fireworks. Well, I don't think they go towards them. I think they just look at them from wherever oh, they are. So, maybe. so I don't think they'd walk towards it. Possibly. You're probably right. Okay, well, let's we'll take a look at it from the outside. It's pretty crazy. Now, yeah. when you first open it up, you're like, wait, is there a park in here? What is this? <laughs> right? Yeah. But the, yeah, I mean, he's created so much in there. It's kind of insane. like it's because they're against each other. Does it even fit? How is this the thing? I don't think it fits. Uh, well, I can I can see he's still left the the I guess it does the borders in there on the tray. Oh, huh. so weird. Yeah. Yeah, when you, you go, wow, what? there's so much in there that you would, it's unsuspecting, isn't it? Yes, yes, it absolutely is. Especially with the, the coasters, because it didn't even, you would expect that on the mouse coaster, you'd see a lot of the the, the inverted coaster and vice versa. And you didn't. The same again with the Huntsman. But it's like, they're completely separate. You'd have no idea the other ones sort of existed. And to squeeze all that in in a 40 by 40 space is really crazy. Well, you, can't, you can't really ex see this great a day i think what we need to do is ride another one of the coasters okay we'll check it out a day just so people can get an idea i think the magic is at night but hey it's a bonus 
We're not. It's yeah. It's kind of similar to uh, the Mad Men's Park, where it's like you know, right. a day you you, <laughs> you you just look at it a day just so you can actually see how everything was done, rather than but where it shines mm -hmm. is at night. Yeah, you definitely see a lot more of that terrain work mixed in with the branches and how it fits. It was a little bit more clear, but it's still puzzling, isn't it? Yeah, it is. And it, it's a... Uh, it it's also a really nicely done coaster. It's 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 really smooth and it it feels good. Yeah. Wasn't expecting more after this lift hill. I, I thought right. this was the end. Quite but a bit then, more. Yeah, so that was a pleasant surprise. Okay. Um, wow. Boogie, 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 boogie. This is quite something special. Most, one of the most unique creations in the, the contest. I'd say, like, between this and that Malacostra Park, they're both very unique in the sense that they're like, they've taken to the skies. They've done something magical. Um, I think the two of you guys are kind of prying at one of the, 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 the magical, um, fantasy creations in that contest and it's, this is just truly something next level and different i quite love it um it's great uh <laughs> and speaking <laughs> to that um didn't boogie and denise babis get first and second of the last contest and they were competing in the expert bracket they definitely they seem to I be believe so. they seem I to be so. hitting I the same so. beats as each other unknowingly <laughs> i have a good feeling that you two might be going head to head on this one again because you both did something really different and i think when it gets down to the master bracket that's what's gonna set people apart right who because everyone in the master bracket so far from what I've seen is just doing there nothing is just gen generic anymore everything is completely wild and crazy the masters right. are always taking leaps trying something different and um it's it's going to come down to you know it's not just about who does the best rides shops ride skins anymore it's kind of just who who does them who puts the most magic in their creation and there's definitely a lot, of, a lot of mana in this magic. Absolutely, it's really well done. And you're you're right. Uh, Bug, did, Bug did the Lord of the Rings, which came first. Denise did the Hidden World, which came second. And then Blubber did Frostburn, which came third. Well, I wonder where Blubber is in this contest. <laughs> Bless is more. Sometimes Bless it's is more. Better if he's not here. <laughs> <laughs> Kitty Blubber, we love you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is incredible. Do you have any final thoughts? I think I've said what I wanted to say. It's a magical, yeah. and that sums it up. It, I love it. Abs absolutely. You covered everything. It's yeah, it's really nicely done. Well done, Buck. Okay. Well, there you go, everyone. That was Tain Mahuta, created by Bukhul. What did you guys think? Leave your comments down below. And uh, that's going to do it for this episode of Park Spotlight. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you have a wonderful day, and we'll see you in the next submission. Bye now. Bye now. Bye now.